Team Guam will be heading to Port Moresby, Papua New Guinea this Saturday to prepare for the FIBA U15 Oceania Championship. Guam has been grouped with powerhouse countries Australia, New Zealand, and Samoa. Coach Brent Tipton says the team is looking forward to the matchup with New Zealand in their opener and will be focusing on playing with pace and space. Obviously the ultimate goal is to, to medal and to finish in the top three. So that's where our sights are at and we've been working hard to get there. Defensively, I feel like our strength is definitely our full court pressure. So we're really gonna put a lot of ball pressure in transition and then in the half court, put a lot of man pressure on the ball. For the last three months, the boys have been putting in work at the National Training Center, building team chemistry. Coach Tipton says the togetherness of the squad will be another factor in the boys' success at the tournament. We all know each other personally outside of this team also. We spend a lot of time with each other uh, also outside of basketball. Through this training, we've learned to come together not only as athletes, but as brothers uh, united under one goal, and that is to bring home the gold from this championship. The championship team from the competition will move on to play in the Asian Championships in 2019. With the success of our men's national team program, the doors are now opening for our junior national teams. I'm very grateful that I made the team. All these guys are experienced, playing ever since they were little. We work hard every day to try getting to a higher competition level, and uh, we hope we place a medal in Papua New Guinea. Our men's national basketball team improved to 2-0 in pool play at the FIBA Asia Cup qualifiers after beating out Singapore last night, 107-57. to Irv Jose banging out the deep ball here for Team Guam. Our national team was led by Ernest Ross Jr., who hit four game-high 19 points. Ross feasting on the competition. J.P. Cruz picked up where he left off in game one. Cruz on fire with his outside shooting. Big man Curtis Washington making the highlight reels in Thailand. Washington with another two-handed dunk, assisted by Ty Wesley. Defensively, the team was on lockdown. Still here, Darren Hetchnova gets to finish the other way. Team Guam is on the court as we speak, taking on the host country, Thailand. In programming news, Monday, December 3rd on the stations of KUAM, 4 in the morning, NFL on CBS, KUAM TV 11. The Buffalo Bills head to Miami to take on the Dolphins. Then at 11.15 in the morning, switch the channel over to KUAM TV 8 for NBC Sunday Night Football. Phillip Rivers and the L.A. Chargers taking on Big Ben and the Pittsburgh Steelers.